Hi, I'm John. You've just come at the right time. I'd like to welcome you to our fantastic Vintage Emporium. We do period costumes from Roman times right through to modern day. In fact, if you bear with me, I'll show you around. Let's go. And the most fantastic thing about this business, they're all originals. Take for example, 1950s. Can't be that. I've got something to show you now. Not fifth, sixth or seventh. This is Henry the eighth. Complete with dagger, sir. How wonderful. Now we enter the Western room. Here we've got Indians, saloon girls, we can do Billy the Kid, Davy Crockett, Wild Bill Hickok, all the saloon girls' dresses, absolutely fantastic and stunning. We've got all the bits, pieces from head to toe, all the masks. And now I'll just point out our special thing. And here we've got behind the door our Mississippi gambler. Doesn't he look dangerous? I wouldn't play a card with him, would you? And here we've got an assortment of things. We've got showgirls, cabaret, how about that then? We've got ringmasters, toastmasters, all kinds of masters. On the other side, we've got all the dresses from the turn of the century, from 1900s up to the present day. That's an assortment of evening dresses. So if you want to do a specific thing, we've got Elvis Presley, leg shakers, to bullfighters. Now we move on to the 1920s. We've not only got the dresses, we've got the coats, the hats, the bags, the shoes, all these outfits, regardless of what era you go into. We've got the high kickers. We can even do Bonnie and Clyde. Look at the quality, all originals. We're now going through to the 1940s section. All the military, civilian, choppers, English, American, German, Army, Navy, Air Force, all originals, just waiting for somebody to slip into them. This is a few collection of Hello Hello, RAF, we have in all the different kinds, not only your officers, we've got battle dresses, all the hats, the helmets. Here we go, American Army. Notice they've all got the insignia on and everything. Totally complete from top to toe. And they built on. Absolutely, totally top to That's one of the American hats that's uh, trying to do me in. But there you go. This is some of your American shirts with all the emblems and everything. Here we've got British Navy, American Navy. This is all the ladies section. British, American, Red Cross. Absolutely anything that you want. RAF. Some real high flyers have been wearing these. Here we go, girls. Some of the American Navy. Pearl Harbor dresses. There we go. All the hats, as you can see above. We've got to land army girls here, land army girls bags, military hats, all the different types. Now we're going to go through to uh, the uh, mess dress room. Follow me. Here we've got the land army girls, all the various things that go to building land army outfits. I think there's too many of them. 
all your mess dress. Absolutely stunning outfits here. These tend to be worn on an evening by the gentlemen in the mess when they're smoking their big fat cigars. Here we go. Tailcoats. Bandman's uniforms. These go very, very well with the uh, steampunk or John Lennon and the Beatles for the era when they did. Uh, that actually came out of the palace, I do believe. Okay, I'm just going to walk you around a little bit the military section because this tends to be a very, very large area. You know, all the German things. British, American, Army, Navy, Air Force. It just goes on and on. And if you can see all the hats above, hats for every occasion. All your naval. <sighs> British Army. Now we're going to the blue room. All the ball gowns. We do traditional dress for men and boys for weddings, as you can see. First and Second World War pilots, jackets behind me. These ball gowns, just have a look, all the different ones, different eras. Ah, absolutely stunning. Each one tells a story. We can use these for saloon girls, for Victorian, Edwardian. They're just absolutely gorgeous. Everyone makes a woman a dream. All the different styles, they just go on and on and on. Can you just picture yourself on the deck of a cruise ship, decked out like a princess, with all the jewellery, long gloves, looking glorious. I said glorious, not notorious. The Busby type, the Scottish Busby type things, and quite a few of the hats, the top hats, the bowler hats, and all the different sizes of hats. Right, I'll just show you some of the helmets that these poor unfortunate people had to wear when they were fighting. Can you believe it? Oh, that's for sand dunes. We've got absolutely fire service, English, American, German. They just go on and on and on. In fact, I'm going to be a Tommy now. Now, last but not least, we'll just peruse the accessories. Bit of a trekker. Holsters, shoulder holsters. More sh shoulder holsters, 1920s beads, pilots' helmets, pilots' goggles, all the different kinds of glasses, roller boots, skates, Sam Browns, Western guns and holsters, your money or your wife. few of the vintage capes and various garments. Look at that. Stunning, eh? Absolutely. We've got helmets. We've got Robert the Bruce. All the daggers and knives and, in fact, don't hold me back from one of my favourites, Al Capone, your money or your life. 
more holsters, all the accessories for the jewelry, the beads. Take a look down here and here we've got all your badges, your brooches, more jewelry. Genuine Victorian purses. Halloween. Masquerade masks. German gas masks. I hope we don't need them. Right, well I've shown you around. You've seen most everything. Why not give me a ring, that's John or Vore, as soon as you can. Come on down. Is that all right?